what size it is. And I don't care. <laughs> Let's see. It's a size F. Fucking <laughs> <Get> ugly. <laughs> Sorry. thrift store in Ukiah. And should we talk about, like first before we start this, should we talk about what's happened since we made, like we used to do shop, grocery shopping hauls and family yeah. videos and stuff. But we have had a lot of changes. Mm -hmm. Kate got married and we moved to a different city, which we love mm -hmm. so much. Back and, in California. Yeah, and we started a new business on Poshmark. So now we are way obsessed with Poshmark. And so we've always loved to thrift, but now we're thrifting for money. Yeah. Yeah. So Poshmark is basically an app where you just sell clothes and like accessories and, um, you know, like hats, jewelry, um, no like hard goods, not like eBay. It's just like clothing, strictly mm -hmm. clothing. So yeah, we can go to a thrift store and buy something for a couple dollars and go and sell it for sometimes 50 or more on the really good items. And generally we try to get good brands that people want. Sometimes we'll get some vintage things that, because mm -hmm. vintage sells good too, but. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so um, we spent $140 total today on most of the stuff. There's a few things from last thrift haul that we'll put in this video, but $140 and I don't know how many items we got. Oh my gosh. Yeah. We we are going to say prices of things because I think that's cool when we watch videos to see how much something costs um, and then what somebody ends up selling it for. I think and there was a great deal today at this shop because um, yellow tags were 50 cents, mm -hmm. t-shirts were 99 cents, mm -hmm. and green tags were half off. Yes. So we tried to concentrate mostly on great deals. Sale, sale yes. stuff. Yeah. Okay. So. These are a pair of, these were 50 cents. These are Elemento Which is jeans. Awesome. And they're size three. They have to be vintage because I haven't heard of Elemento for a long time. Uh -uh. Yeah, so anything with yellow tag, 50 cents. They're in really good shape for being uh, what I think is vintage. Unless they brought them back, I don't know, but we'll they're see. Cute. We'll research and find out. Yeah, they're really cute. So there's that. Go ahead, get another one. These are, ooh, Wit and Wisdom. I looked them up. I like looked at the comps in the in the store, and it, they were pretty good, like forty five dollars. Wow. Um, and these were jeans are six forty nine. Women's and men's jeans are six forty nine, and then half off. The green okay. ties were half off. So it was. She, but she only charged us like two dollars for a lot of pair of jeans, and then yeah. three dollars max. Yeah. So she got real confused because we had so much stuff. Yeah. Okay. What are Okay, these were half off too. You're gonna hate these. Rag City Blues. I hate the name. <laughs> yeah, they're like vintage, obviously, and they ain't got no butt pockets. They're rolled up a little bit. Yeah. <clears throat> but yeah, I thought for that price. And it looks like they've got a pretty high rise, which mm -hmm. is what we look for because people really want the mom jeans now. Do you want me to get the measuring oh, tape? Oh yeah, I want you to get the measuring tape. Yeah, yeah we, we've got tough. some that are actually 12 inches, which is amazing. We've got uh, one pair of um, short, like vintage shorts with like a bear on them and they're 14 and a half inch rise. <laughs> I can't find it. Uh oh. Oh, is it on a mannequin? No. Darn it, we've lost our measuring tape. It should be, oh wait, anyway, it's a big rise. Yeah, it's a big rise. So those but will yeah. go up as mom jeans. Absolutely. And which so used to be totally hideous and now are definitely in style. Yep. So there's those. Oh, that's your situation. Another pair of Elemino. Mm -hmm. These look brand new almost. Yeah, those, those look really shape. new. Those look awesome. Those were 50 cents. Yeah, small size, but. Yeah, what size are these ones? Those are, there are three too, so we could either sell them as a lot or yeah. separately, whatever. But yeah, those are in really good shape. Um, we got a lot of jeans today. These were half off their, that brand, I never want to try to say that because I almost said BB. It looks like BB. 
Um, but these are interesting jeans. I've never seen that kind of mm -hmm, that pattern's odd detail on them. It's it's like a not, is it cross stitch? It kind of looks like it. Does. Yeah, yeah, it is cross stitch yeah. with some little rhinestones. Yeah. Um, and that, how much were those? The green tag they were half off. She right? rang these up as two dollars. Okay, good. So, yeah. That's pretty cute though. Yeah. And they're size 28. These are awesome and they were half bought. They were uh, 50, 50 cents. cents. They're Levi jeans. Again, they're a small size, but like a tartan type print. And I think they're new because they still have this little tag. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they feel new too. Yeah. Okay, these are seven premium <laughs> jeans, size 28. They're cute. They're very cute butt pockets. What a, a half off, so like two, three dollars is what they yeah. rang up as. Those are very cute. Very good. Good deal. This I was excited about because I saw the other day when I went there for the first time to this thrift store, and I was like, that's adorable. It's like a velvet crop top, but it was like, at the time it was like $4 and I didn't Ooh, want to pay that. That's soft. So today it was 50 cents yeah, and it's nice. by Ivy and Maine and it's a size small, but it is cute. Very that cute. is cute. Do you think it's a junior size? Um, I don't know. This is Alex Marie, size six, new with tags. And these would have been one fifty, and the price tag says eighty nine dollars on them. Wow. Yeah, and they're they're nice. They're, they're not very like funky. nice. And never wore it. So cool. Very cool. Speaking of never worn, we found what has to be a pair oh of vintage. Oh my gosh! I forgot about those. Vintage LEI jeans. <laughs> in a size seven, so they're definitely juniors. And interesting details on the pockets. Yeah, really, really cute. And these were, these were full price, so these were like six, six dollars, but those are cute. Oh, I yeah. dig them. Okay, these are? For Dash. We got a oh, these few are things for, for the kids. For Dash, okay. He's gonna love that. Comfy pants, what yeah. brand are those? He always doesn't wanna wear jeans. Aesthetic Revolution, hmm. Thrive, Achieve, and Conquer. Hmm. Yeah, they're cute though. And they're really good quality. Yes. Nice. Can he wear those to school? Uh, probably. Okay. He'll probably end up wearing them to school. Yeah. So. Okay, this I probably would never get forever. That was weird. Again. I thought that was a weird thing for you to buy. Well, it was 50 cents. So it was 50 cents and I heard that Forever 21 plus sizes do really well. This is a Forever 21 plus size. So it's kind of an odd, kind of an odd dress. But I mean, it might go like around prom time or graduation time or something, yeah. who knows? Or just for like a weird, I don't know, some weird event that you need a certain color for, who knows? But for 50 cents, I mean, even if we sold it for 10 bucks, we'd make a profit, yes. you know? And I love this and I wish that you could feel it because it's so soft. It's it ridiculously is. soft. It's an Alfred Dunner, which is a good designer brand. And we don't know. I mean, sometimes you just don't know when you buy something if anybody will be interested or not, but oh, it's, it's a petite. It's a petite. Alfred yeah. Dunner, though, is not a good, like, to resale. No. Resale. Uh, resale value is not good. Well, I, but, yeah, yeah, but I see a lot of Alfred Dunners, yeah. so. But if, yeah, if it wasn't a petite, I would keep it if it didn't sell, but mm -hmm. I don't think I could squeeze into it. Yeah, it's that's really cute. All right, these are, these were full price, so $3.99, I think, or $3.50 or something. But they're Betsy Johnson um, Performance, extra small, but I think these are cute. Mm -hmm. Those are they're cute. Odd. Oh, they're, they're Capri, cute. aren't they? I are they Capri? I think so. I think they're just for a short one, mm. but no, they probably hang kind of low and like, but they have the cute little, whatever that is, zipper mm -hmm. on the back, cute pockets, so yeah, those are Okay, cute. this one is White House Black Market, which does surprisingly well for us. Yeah, it does really good. Which is, yeah, it's weird because I guess some people 
just can't sell it but for some reason every time we put something up every somebody time. buys it so yep. it's cute it's a sweater with some rhinestones on it and white is supposed to be popular this fall so which is weird it's very strange yeah. seems more like a summer color to me but mm -hmm. yeah and that was half off did you say that oh no i didn't yeah that okay. was half, half off so that was about two dollars okay okay this i was excited about too these were full price but they're seven for all mankind and I don't know how to tell yet. They're size 30. Um, boot cut. I don't know how to tell yet the style. But the pockets look like that. Yeah, so they're definitely boot cut. Yeah. Yeah, but cute. And I mean, even we'll make our money back. That's for sure. Good brand. Yep. All right. These are Monarda. Monarda. Half off. But look at that. That's funky. It, it is funky. And we have other pairs of jeans we in the do. closet. That and are... I don't know if it's like a new thing or an old thing. I can't tell if they're vintage or if they're new made to look vintage. And this is very like vintage inspired because it's mm -hmm. like a, I don't know, it's weird. But this yeah, it's got skinny leather. jeans. Look, it's got leather here on the pocket. Yeah. Yeah, they're odd. I don't know. But I think they're kind of cute. And I what mean, was the price on those? Half off. So, and I think, though, again, that was like two bucks or something. Okay. It was really cheap. We got good deals today. Okay, so <laughs> this, I'm so excited about that this. That is fantastic. It's so cute. It's like, I don't want to say that this is a Japanese brand if it's like a Chinese brand. Because I don't know. Yeah, I, I don't know either. We'll have to research it and find out. Um, <clears throat> this, look at that. This was, here, let's see. Okay, first of all, here's the hood. The hood is ears, has ears on it, and then it's got like, oh my God. A, it's like a kangaroo pouch. Look, it's got paw prints. Yeah, it's so, so cute. And look, it's got this thing on it. Yeah, it's got a little drawstring, and then it has... Keep your baby in there. Other pockets, it's all soft in there. <laughs> Jesus yeah, it's Christ, this is so, so cute. cool. And the yeah. pom-poms and everything. And then there's like these little, oh, it's got like thumb holes. Oh my gosh. And like, oh, it's just the I love cutest. it. And is it brand new? It's brand it new with brand tags. New. It is. Don't even try. Yeah, I, I don't know what brand it, it is, yeah. but it is absolutely adorable. Yeah. And it's soft inside. Probably one of our best, if not our best deal today. Yeah. Our best find. Yep. I wish that I could hold it up better, but it's really hard to do. Yeah. So cute. And it, what size is this? Small. But it looks like medium-ish to me, but I don't know. All right, I haven't seen this one yet. Must have been in your cart. Mm -hmm. It was full price. Nickelodeon. I just thought it was cute. It is, oh, it's got all the Nickelodeon characters on mm -hmm. it. That's very cute. And it is a size medium, so. Yeah, I like that. That's very cool. It's very cute. All right, these I also paid full price for, so like six. But they're guest jeans, and they are, let's see, size 31. <laughs> <laughs> You're not I, fooling I, anybody. <laughs> You're weird. I had to vape real quick. <laughs> All of a sudden, you just go <laughs> off camera real it sounds slow. sounds like a respirator. <laughs> I need my CPAP for one it's second. Like oxygen. <laughs> All right. But yeah, so I think these are really cute. They're obviously like boot or maybe even a flare. But guest jeans, they're good. So yeah, they're very good. It's a larger size. So and good. these, I think, are so interesting. It's houndstooth. It's not. Um, yeah, it's houndstooth. And yeah. What is it? Pilco. And the what? And the letterpress. And it's anthropology. Wow. Yeah, those yeah. are so cute. And you probably can't see very well, but they are houndstooth. And just to find denim, we found a pair the other day that were um, pinstriped denim. Mm -hmm. I just think it's so unusual and so cool. So these are vintage cachet jeans. Party in the front, business in the back. <laughs> yeah, they're they're like jeans. The weirdest thing. Yeah. And these are actually like a a slack type, I don't know, a stretchy yeah. material in the back. What's that? Oh. I've never seen anything like those. I haven't. And then we got a little leather. Mm -hmm. A little leather accent. These are Size sixes. Yeah, so those are those are some pants. I don't know how you can 
I don't know how you'd wear these, how what you or how we're gonna describe them. Hopefully, we can find somebody else who's described them. <laughs> this is the Paris Blues black denim jacket with sheer sleeves, which is pretty amazing. I think that's really cute, and yes. it's obviously vintage because I don't think Paris Blues is around anymore. No, and it would look really cute with skinny jeans. Very, mm -hmm. very cute. Yeah, I think that's super cute, and we paid up for that just a teeny tiny bit. Oh, it was $4.99. That's yeah. not bad. $4.99 isn't bad. We're used to paying little, little bit. Yeah. Okay, these are Lucky Brand, and I think, I don't know what we're going to do with these yet. But these were full price, but they're Lucky Brand. So I might wear them if they fit me. Yeah. Butt looks like that. They're in really good shape. They're like still darker. Yeah. Okay, this was, oh, 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 oh. This is Torrid. This was $4.99 too. But it is interesting. Yeah, I kind of like Torrid stuff. Mm hmm. It's definitely like a little more fashionable. Like, I mean, it's not like a. Yeah. I don't know. But yeah, it's a Torrid size 2. And it's kind of got like the. I don't know if this would be considered like a moto type thing, but it's Is kind of a moto awesome. sideways. It, it might be like kind of. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But I think it's adorable. It and is. It's really I like cute. Heard, nice over top. Yeah. And I've heard that Torrid does really good. And in our. Oh, that's cute. You can wear it like that, too. Oh, yeah. Cool. Um, but, yeah, so the stuff that we've had that's been toured has done, we've sold it all. So. Okay, let's pick up the color a little bit. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> These are Kardashian jeans. And they are in a very large size, which is awesome because the girls don't have a lot of choice. No, we don't. I don't know what size they are though. I don't either, but I bet Let's we can see. find it. 24. 24. So these were half off, so yeah. I think these were like $1.50. And they're long, aren't they? They're long, and I believe that they're tapered or skinny. I'm not sure. Those are cute. They're cute, yeah. Nice orange color for fall. Yeah. Oh, I'll let you do that mustard colored one. Okay, mom found this. It was 50 cents, and it is cute as heck cabby like Look the old that. cabby it's tag got the, the frayed bottom it's corduroy for it's fall really cute and that's also a bigger size which is nice it's an eight it looks a little bit larger than it an does eight look bigger. but yeah that's really cute and for 50 cents yeah that's excellent the older tag cabby though like when i see it now because we have a couple shirts that haven't sold I'm like me but if something's 50 cents then yeah you, you can't know. really go wrong with that these are Citizens of Humanity. Yeah. And they are low waist, full leg, fay. I don't know the size right yet. 24. 24. So it's very small. But they were half off. So two to three dollars. Yeah. Cute. I was excited about those. And they do have like they're, they're flares, too. Yeah, they do look like they're... They have a little wear on the bottom, but... Mm -hmm. I think they're really cute. Mm -hmm. To be washed. <laughs> Needing to be washed, and it is speed limit. Mm. Does it have shoulder pads? I don't think it does. It looks like it might have a little discoloration right there. Like someone might have died in it. <laughs> like, it's gonna I bet be... it was a fun death, though. <laughs> they were probably at a disco. <laughs> We need to spray and wash it and see if it'll come out. Yeah. Because it is. But, I mean, it's it's hella vintage, so. Yeah, it is. Um, that's, and it's weird that it's got, like, the elastic around the around here, but it doesn't there. Mm -hmm. I think that's kind of unusual. So you can be really wide, but you need to be super short. <laughs> or you could wear it and be all fashionable. Like, yeah. I don't know. Your turn. Oh, okay. Okay, this thing was 50 cents, and I was telling mom in the car that I'm curious to see if this is actually going to do well, and for 50 cents we can try it. But it's Lane Bryant, and it is a size 22-24. We haven't sold Lane Bryant before. Uh-uh. And I mean, it would be a nice work shirt or something. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, it's kind of, I don't know what the, it's 100% polyester. <laughs> so, we'll see. We will know. see. All right, what's next? Hollywood and Vine. 2X. Yeah, big size, so that's why I was like, mm. Oh, yeah, the black. 
And it's it's like a basic, so mm -hmm. it should sell well. And it was fifty cents. I don't think people stop needing this kind of stuff, like to work for work mm -hmm. and stuff, you know. So it's got like a little kick pleat in the back, which is cute. But it def I mean it's it would be risky to to wear it at work because oh. it's literally just open. Oh, I thought so, it was a pleat. With a like something under it. But. Yeah. But yeah, and the buttons are interesting. I mean, it doesn't look like a super high quality, high end piece, but I don't know. We should look it up. Yeah, we should. Yeah, what is it, Hollywood and Vine? Hollywood and Vine. <clears throat> I was looking for the fabric so I could look up. Is it, I don't think it's silk, but I don't know, maybe partially. Nope, 100% polyester, once again. Okay. But yeah, it's, it's cute. I mean, I think the back makes it look cuter. I have no idea what brand these are, P, B, and C. I, they look different to me. They look like slightly better quality than some jeans. So I figured for 50 cents would take a, take a chance. Yeah, because they're a larger size, right? Yeah, they're 36, 32, yeah. so. Um, there's only care. two items on your Hollywood and Vine. Mm. It's not looking good. Not looking great. But it's a large size, and yeah. I do think large sizes are yeah. a thing. Yeah, I think you'll be able to get James in those later. But, yeah. He's probably going to want to keep them. He's so weird. Yeah, those are cute. They're very cute. They're soft. They're like silky. And they're purple. Mm-hmm. And they're Star Wars. Star Wars. And those were, I think, $3 or something. No. Okay. Dan Skin um, 4X, which is really hard to find in the larger sizes. Yeah, and they're in really good shape. They don't have like, I know with my fat girl clothes, um, like a pair of pants like this would definitely have spaghetti or something on them. Yes, definitely. Um, some Togos. paint. Togos. Yeah. yeah. And look, there's no rub marks. From the chub. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So yeah. That's, that's a nice pair of pants. Yeah, and even though they're dance skin, like I know they're not super expensive, but I know being big, like it's hard to find. So hard to find something yeah. decent. And they were 50 cents, so you can, give a good deal to somebody who can't or yep. doesn't want to go look for a, yep. a big pair of pants. So I'm going to grab a couple of these. Okay. Um, this, I just heard that the like school shirts were going to be in. So this says Princeton and it was a dollar. So kind of cute. And this, I just have a good feeling about. But what does this one say? The best fry is the one at the bottom of the bag. Yeah. McDonald's. And I don't know if they're like employee shirts, like but I don't really know, but for a dollar, cute. It's cute. And it's a nice color. And mm -hmm. we have another one of those mm -hmm. that says something different, I think. It says, when life hands you onions, make a quarter pounder. Mm. Oh. That's not quite as catchy as the other one. <laughs> <laughs> but Bazzy, he's yeah. going to be like, oh, I hate onions. Oh, he's going to be like, I love quarter pounders. Yeah, that's true. Um, this is an adult size small. So we got that one. Okay, it looks like we got a few more things in there. It's a grab bag. Okay, this thing was, I looked at this last time. It was full price and I was like, meh. But it was 50 cents this time. Mm. I, both you and James were like, ew. I think it's cute. I like it. Well, I don't I'm just it. thinking about how I'm gonna steam that. You're not. You're not gonna steam it. But yeah, 50 cents and it's Umi by Umi by life. Well, sometimes things surprise me. Yeah. Yeah. I, I like it. It has some unnecessary little diddly squats on it, but... Where, I bet there was... Were there buttons before that went over here? I bet that's it. Buttons were there. No, but this one goes in the back, so I don't think so. I'm not really sure, but I think it's kind of cute. I don't know what size it is. And I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. It's a size F. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> ugly. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. But buy it. It'll be out soon. <laughs> this is um, Andrea Jovin, small. Uh -huh. And it's just a cute striped sweater. And stripes are really in right now. People are really liking the stripes. So it's pretty basic, nice sweater. And the reason I got it is because I was like, it looks vintage to me for sure. Mm -hmm. The tag does for sure. Kind of. It's weird. I don't know about this. But it's a size small, and it was 50 cents. So I was like, you know, 
again any profit that you make on it and we'll find out we just will research it and find out are you, are you smelling stuff again <laughs> <No>. <laughs> andrew you should look that up too okay or, i don't have my phone with me it, okay these i was super excited about because they are they had their zippers unzipped and someone had obviously looked and then rejected them but they're sam edelman i can't probably can't see it but they're sam edelman they have some like little flaws on them but they're cute they're really cute they were 4.99 and like they do have some scuffing on the front are but they leather i'm sure they are i think i think probably just cleaning it up maybe polishing them a little bit mm -hmm. they'd be perfect yeah i mean they we're gonna have to disclose that like there is some imperfections yeah. and stuff but they're they're really cute they're like a Okay. okay, you go. No, you go. No, you keep no. going. Oh, okay. I'm hot. These are my favorite find of the day. Yes. I'm so excited about these. They are guest brand. So cute. They're like soft. High. They're soft. They're in really good shape. We'll clean those babies up. Four ninety nine. Somebody's going to love them. I fully expect to get like 50 bucks for these yeah. at least, so I'm really excited. Yeah, those are in good shape too. Okay, these are older Stuart Weitzman shoes, but they're in super good condition. They were $4.99. Um, they look like they have not been worn. And they have a unique heel, which is supposed to be in for the fall. So, mm -hmm. it, you know, it's a, it's a little different. So it, yeah. it might be good. I'm curious to see how old they actually are. <clears throat> now, I don't know why this says, maybe they're nines. Yeah, I think they're nines. Um, but they're really soft. Mm -hmm. It's very weird. Yeah, those are an odd yeah. material. Yeah, but both all of the Stuart Weitzman shoes that we've had have sold, mm -hmm. even like the older yeah. um, styles. So whatever. These I'm excited about too. I don't know this brand. They're definitely vintage. KB and Company. Hmm. They're a size, looks to be eight, but. I'm like, those are vintage and cute. KB so, and Company? KB and Company. I just think those are adorable. And they're in really good condition. They were $4.99. <coughs> mm. The omelet coming back on you? Mm, yeah. <laughs> okay. We don't want anybody to know when we eat. Uh -uh. Okay, so this... I, I, I don't know about this. This was $2, but it's just 9 West. I got this the other day. And I think it's for a cell phone. I think it would hold my cell phone. What it? Here's. Oh, look. This is just a iridescent, weird case thing. It's like a wallet, too. I don't know. I just thought it was kind of cute because you can. Okay. <clears throat> We only have a couple minutes and our batteries get back. Yeah, so we'll hurry. This is a little plastic, really cute purse. I don't know what it is, you know. Um, I don't think it has a brand or anything, but it's like a Hawaiian kind of looking thing. Very unusual and perfect inside. Yep. Perfect. Awesome, two bucks. It was two bucks, yeah. <clears throat> Oh, <laughs> I was just kind of looking at it myself. Yeah. I was trying to share back some on Poshmark because some cool people, um, this one, who is she? I wanted to, she's got a ton of really cool vintage jewelry, vintage Cafe C, but look at her jewelry. Oh, wow. And um, we just put up a bunch of, a bunch of vintage jewelry, so I kind of wanted to see her prices. Mm-hmm. Which is a lot more expensive than ours. Yeah, much, but cool, cool stuff. Right. So I wanted to share her stuff. Okay, so this is a Bruno Lorelli purse. And I've seen like this color combination and stuff lately. So it's, it's a good thing. for fall, nice fall colors. Yeah. And I paid $2 for this too. And then there's this big thing. Yeah. That was from Goodwill a while ago. I have not. It's a Kate Spade. It is a Kate Spade. It does have like a little damage, like just wear. But we paid, I think, $15 for it. So it was a little more expensive. That's so cute. That's really cute. And the inside is very nice. 
Mm-hmm. What's the inside and look it's like? It's striped and nice. Yeah. And it's got a long handle and a short handle, mm -hmm. which is awesome. Yeah. Okay, what's next? Okay. We gotta hurry. Mm-hmm. So this is just a wallet that it was like a dollar somewhere, and I thought it was kind of cute, but I don't know what I'll do with it. I don't know if it's worth listing or what. And then this one has a, is it a cat? Or is it a leopard? It's or a something? leopard. A leopard. Very sparkly. It's cute. I don't know if we haven't listed it yet. It's Betsyville, so Betsy Johnson. Betsy Johnson. I like the gold and silver together. Mm -hmm. I've really been into that lately. Ooh, that's a cute label. Yeah, it's adorable. Look at that. That's adorable. That is so yeah. cute. Yeah, we got to get that listed. We bought that when we were still in Oregon. So, yeah. yeah. But yeah, awesome. we we have also like an entire. Well, we have two more closets full of stuff. These things we you haven't steamed or anything yet, but half of it. Oh, okay. I hung a lot of the new stuff up, so we can do mm -hmm. another haul maybe before we post all that stuff. Yeah. Hopefully, this will probably realistically be a few weeks before we get everything posted. For yeah, this haul, but, but we should start making videos as we sell, like what sold this week, mm -hmm. so people can see what these things are actually bringing, you know? Yeah, absolutely. And yeah, we spent 140 but we did buy the kids some stuff, so I would say closer to probably... And I have a couple things in there. Yeah, probably closer to 100 120 We should have counted our items. There's a lot. Mm-hmm. And we can do that before, and I can okay. just put in a little yeah. like yeah. thing about it. But yeah, I think we did pretty good, and I love that thrift store. I think yeah. it is the best thrift store. Excellent. It's such good prices. And, and the lady that worked there, works there, her name was Marlena. Marlena. And I'm always going to remember because Marlena Dietrich, so I'll always remember that. Or that song, Three Marlena. Uh, hmm. I don't think I've heard that. Three more? Is it Three Marlenas? I don't know, but I'm going to listen to it as soon as we're done. No, you have, because it's like... Is it Why I Love It or Randy Travis or something? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> oh, and that means I have? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Y'all bitch. They're just a couple that I like. <laughs> I like a lot more than that. They have to look that certain way, though. <laughs> 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 Their faces have to be at least this long. <laughs> uh, okay, well, that was <laughs> my type. <laughs> you and Julia Roberts. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, so we'll be back. Yeah, next time. Okay, bye.